Okay guys, so we're in the house. We've had our little look around, making sure like we like it and everything and everything's fine and we're happy with it. I've just filmed at Empty House so for you. It took about three attempts, not gonna lie. <laughs> um, but we did get there in the end. Um, but when we came, we got like some little gifts and a card. So I thought we could open it and see what guys. So it says, <laughs> Thompson and Kaylee. And that's five nine one. Mm, um, so let's see what we've got. So this just says floor homes, that's the development we went with. It says, Dear Thomas and Kaylee, congratulations on your lovely new home. Best wishes. So that's our first little moving in card. And then is this anything exciting? I don't know if open that. This is all the shade, so. That's all of the um, documents of the house. It's not nice looking exciting. That's not a bit. That's all the doc we've got like loads of random paperwork. We've got this, Camel Valley. I don't even know what that is, do you? Oh, be whiskey. Be whiskey. Wine. Wine from Cornwall. Ah, wait. Box. Yeah. My uh, room leader got us a little Prosecco today. So thank you, Caroline. And we've got us some candles. So, you know, I feel like we do have to pop one open today, don't we, at some point? Because, you know, it's a celebration. So, oh, lovely bottle of um, champagne. Champagne. Lovely. So, we've got that to pop open. The thing that caught my eye White Company. The White Company. Very bougie floor homes. Let's see what's inside. Let's see. I'm scared. It only has a severe lack of capability when it comes to opening things. I don't need to keep the fucking tissue paper there. <laughs> oh. Okay, so we've got a, set, a diffuser and we've got a hand and nail gift set. Ooh, yeah, well no, nice let's, so the diffuser is tuber rose, jasmine and cashmere wood. So what comes in here though? Oh, we get hand wash. That's what it is. So we can, that's our first hand wash of the bathroom. And then a hand and nail cream. That's really nice. I'm excited about the diffuser though, because we wanted to get one of those. Yeah, I was going to buy one the other weekend. That's so nice. now we've got a really bougie one. So and that's nice. The, um... I'll put those back in there though, because we're not going to do and that right now. I've got the candles as well. So. Yeah. So the plan now is, like I said, we've got so much stuff in the car. So we're going to go ahead and unpack everything. We're going to go get the home stuff first because we're kind of not sure of what we've got is going to go. So we're going to go ahead and put everything on the sides, but I will show you and we will see what happens. So we've gone to the cars. We've got our kettle and toaster um, and our microwave because we want to just know whether we think they're going to go and where we think we want to put them. So we're going to take those off. So we've got Kenwood Kettle and Toaster and a Breville Microwave. But they're just really cute. Um, so I really hope they are going to go. I think they should be okay. They like this really gorgeous cream. We've got this ribbed on the bottom. It's got ribbed on the lid. It's so pretty. And then it's got this, I think this is the little stand. So if we put that on there. Okay, so this is the toaster. Like I said, it matches the kettle. So it's that creamy colour with the red bottom. Tom really likes this one as well because the actual like, toaster holes are really thick, aren't they? And we like to have quite thick bread, so I feel that's going to work quite well. So yeah, I'll show you when everything's kind of together. This is our microwave. We can't quite decide where to put it yet because the plugs on like the other side, like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's really cute because it kind of goes with the kettle and the toaster, but we're thinking here at the moment. It feels weird to have one with like a little dial because I'm used to like a little electric -y one. It's just a simple a microwave. Really happy with her. So we're gonna go get some of the other bits and place them in the house. So little update. We've got a few more things at the house. So we've put the microwave here for now. I need to wash those up. Don't you think these forks are absolutely huge? Anyways, I need to wash those up. So they're going on my sink pile. Got this drainer from TK Maxx, which is really, really cute. We really like that. Got these tea coffee sugars from Matalan, which you think, because we want black and white. I feel like the black really ties in. Obviously, there's our kettle and toaster I showed you earlier. This is our fruit bowl. This is from Matalan. I love this, but we might put it on the dining table when that comes. These are our little tea towels from B&M. They've got little tassels, which are so cute. Got a swan knife set. It's pretty shit, not gonna lie. They don't really fit in, but it was only £15, so a bargs. But yeah, we're just looking at the covers and trying to decide what we want to put where. We're going to go get some more stuff out of the car, and then we need to go to Santander to change our address. Oh my god, I'm so tired. As you saw, I just brought the suitcases in to the spare bedroom. Basically, we're getting the wardrobes tomorrow. <laughs> Our breath. Um, so we're basically doing back and forth trips in the suitcases. So I'm basically bringing these in here. I'm literally gonna open them right now. 
put you down there. I'm literally going to open them and take everything out of it and we're going to make piles later. I'm doing that later if I'm honest. Um, but they're literally all full to the brim and it doesn't even look like I've touched my room. So I'm basically taking everything out, making piles and yeah, then we can sort them out another day. That's basically the plan. So this is where we're at. We've emptied two of the suitcases, which we're going to take back to mine. I've started making piles. There's actually so many different ones, like tops, trousers, leggings, skirts, pajamas. So it can all later. I can just keep organising it, ready for the wardrobes tomorrow. I've seen our little neighbours in the garden with their dog. They've got a spaniel, huh? Wi-Fi. Oh yeah, do you want to order that? Yeah. Um, but we're going to head to Santander. I'm literally sweating, but look, as I said, I need to go and change our dresses. Look how good the lighting is in here. I can't wait to film. Yeah, we're going to go. We've got back from doing another trip back to the house. Basically, we've got this, where's like the actual box? Sure is. We've got this dinner set from Asda, which is really nice, right? It's like kind of the edges, plates and bowls. So these are the plates. They don't fucking fit in my cupboard. Like, I wanted them like at the top. But it's fine. Like, we've got this cupboard down here. And we're having to put them in here, which is fine. Like, it is what it is. Um, but I just love these plates. Um, and the bowls look like this. So we've got four of each for now, I'm just having to put them in there, which is fine, like that will do. Um, so that's kind of nice. And there's also some little side plates. These on the floor, these are the side plates. So really, really cute, happy with them, it's annoying that the big ones don't fit in the cupboard, but it is what it is. So as we went to Santander, we also stopped to get some chopping boards, we don't have any. So I've got this pack of like three size white ones, so I thought they'd just be good for in the cupboard. And then we really wanted some wooden ones. I found this one for now. It's reduced to six pound. Did I say, where did I say we went? So you get one, because I was meant to say, so I thought I didn't say that. But yeah, this was only six pound. It was really cute. So um, I'm going to put this up on display. I just realised I had my lighting on the wrong setting that whole time. But this is where we're thinking of putting our cups. I got these from Amazon and they came with some glass straws. They're really cute. And we also got some from um, Pasta, which look like this. But yeah, we're just still unpacking lots of shit. It's just a bit crazy in the house. So my mum is currently en route to the house. I feel like I can't get the bright light in right now. It's not really working. She's got a bit lost, but she's nearly here. So I'll show you some more like when we're, um, when she's gone. But we're going to order a first takeaway. So she's going to join us and have that. We're either going to go with German Donner Kebab or um, Five Guys, which I haven't decided yet. So we definitely need to get that thing. It's already quarter past eight. Okay, so we need to get some lights like under here. So it's better lighting. But my mum's around at the moment. She's so cute. Bless her. She's dropped us like... Um, it's some little top up items, so she stops up our little fridge and um, we've just like, popped open a bottle of Prosecco that Caroline got me from work She's got some apple juice cheese, some wine, some ham, some butter and some Fanta and also some like soap, some fairy liquid So I've just washed up our cups so we could have our Prosecco um, So I've washed those up and yeah we've got a little Prosecco, I had to put it in these cups because we haven't yet got Prosecco and wine glasses. We're going to get those from Ikea tomorrow. We've had some issues with Ikea. We thought we could do go there and ask for delivery same day. But apparently they only do that in certain Ikeas and they don't do it in the one nearest to us. So we don't obviously just rent a van because we weren't going to do it because we weren't sure if we needed one. But we still need to pick up like my desk, my mirror and stuff like that. So it might be worth it, but we're not sure yet. Um, but yeah, I don't know if I showed you anything else. Um, I put my chopping board here, I can't remember if I showed you, and these are our little utensils from Amazon. So I've put those there for now, don't know if we're going to keep them there. I've got my Joe Milan candles, we need to put them somewhere. We got this from B&M the other day, how cute is this? I think this on the dining table, like when people are around with like little dips or wallets or something, would be really, really cute. I've also got these salt and pepper shakers, but we're going to put those on the dining table. There's quite a lot out on the side, obviously this isn't staying, but you know, like the stuff at the back. But obviously we've said the fruit bowl will probably go on the um, dining table. Um, so yeah, we're going to put the glasses in there though. I've put the plates in there, like I said. Um, we've put, so in here at the moment, we've got some utensils and my straws from some of my cups. And we've got some chopping boards, grater and a colander in there. 
and the baking trays are in there and then my mum also got some bread and wraps I, we haven't got a bread bin at the moment i don't know if we're going to get one so i thought this could probably be like a little pantry cupboard so baked beans bread that kind of thing um but yeah the <laughs> kitchen just has so much stuff you know it's all part of the process the lighting's a bit better over here and um, it's all part of the process and um, it's so fun we've currently ordered a five guys it's nine o'clock still not here we are so hungry so hopefully it comes in a minute <laughs> yummy yummy i got a little cheese <laughs> and chips what do we get two regular chips and they're fucking huge so we've come upstairs my mum has given us the blow up bed <laughs> Which kind of gives us the idea of what a double is going to be like in this room. But we're not sure if we're still going to get the king. I've put some soap and toothbrush holders in here. I've actually just taken our toothbrushes. So they can go in there. And I also got this mouthwash the other day from B&M. This is the peach and mint one. So I'm going to try that. But I'm going to try out the shower for the first time. Which is really exciting. Um, I got this body wash from TK Maxx the other day. The Bayless and Hardin collagen one. So I'm going to test that out. Got a new little bin there, so we do need a bin bag, but let's test out the shower. Okay, so I just had my first shower in the house and it was really, really nice. Um, I'm going to brush my teeth now in the ensuite. Um, we've got, I bought with me the toothpaste I got in another vlog. This one's from, what's it called? Cure Box, and it's like a flavoured toothpaste. So this is grapefruit and bergamot. It's actually really nice. Um, I didn't think it would be because it's great fruit. And then I've also got another new Waken mouthwash, which is peach and mint, which I just showed you. So we can try that as well because I'm intrigued to see what that one tastes like because I do have the minty one. But when I originally went to get one of those from Boots, I did want the... Oh, okay, real quick. <laughs> I did want the flavoured ones, but they didn't have any. So they did look when I last went to B&M, so I thought... We can try that out together, but I used my new um, Famous and Harden body wash. That was really nice as well. It smelled really good. I feel really refreshed. Like I said, it's quite nice in here because out my bedroom at home, it's so hot and it's so nice and cool in here that I actually feel like I can wear pyjamas and not feel like I'm dying. Um, but yeah, let's really Okay, so let's try the peach and mint mouthwash because I'm intrigued to see what it's going to taste like. Ooh. Smells very sweet actually. Let's see, so I'm trying to do it at the same time. Oh my god, that fucking mouthwash is so minty. Like it's really fruity, like the peach, I can tell it's peach like flavour. Um but it's like so minty, like, but I feel like mouth wash always feels really minty in your mouth. Um, anyways, I'm gonna head into bed. I mean, not actually bed. Tom's gonna have a shower too. Um, but I'm gonna spend the rest of the evening basically getting things done. So we need to um, order Wi Fi, we need to order some furniture um, and things like that. So we're gonna spend the evening doing that so we know that they're definitely coming um, next week. Um, so that's kind of the plan and then just work out what we're doing tomorrow so yes I will speak to you in the morning good morning happy Saturday it's currently I don't even know 8am we're trying to figure out what we want to do because we need to go to Ikea I don't know if I said yesterday um, it's really echoing here I'm so sorry um, in, we thought we could get the wardrobes delivered if we went to Ikea we could get the same day, but the one near us doesn't do that. So we need to basically hire a van if we want to get the wardrobes today. Um, so we're trying to find one that the week can afford, and that is also available today. So <clears throat> Tom is looking at that now, because we thought if we can get it anywhere that's not too bad a price, we can go to Ikea to get the wardrobes, then we can go back to my house at home to get like my desk, my mirror, my shelves, my drawers, things like that that we were going to need to bring at some point anyway and then we can do like repack the suitcases, we can do like the rest of the clothes, the rest of the stuff on my desk kind of just get it all over in one go, so it would kind of be quite good, um, so that's what Tom's trying to figure out now um, we slept on the airbed, I'm not going to lie it wasn't comfy, but you know, it's all part of the process um, so yeah, I've got up now, I think I'm going to go and wash up the plates from yesterday because I just don't want them to be like 
stuck there and I just don't know when I'm going to have the next chance to do it. Oh, sorry. So no, let's go do that. Time to choose what I want to wear of the select few items I have. I don't even think I have any jumpers. Although I am going back to my house, but I don't really have time to go in there. So let's just see what we can find. Okay, so this is the fit we've gone for. It's this. I haven't actually worn this yet. This is from Sheen. Little crop knitted jumper. I've got a little top on underneath in case I get hot. And these joggers from Nike. Because I thought I just want to be comfy, like moving all my shit and building. I just need to be comfy. But I'm just waiting for Tom to get out of the shower so I can brush my teeth and do my skincare. So this is the state of my room at home because we've literally just thrown everything everywhere. So I've brought the two suitcases back to repack. Tom and Steve are getting the van and then they're going to bring it here so I can put like, my desk and my mirrors and that in there. So let's start organising. I'll come back to you when it's sorted. Okay, so I'm just having a little break because honestly I'm actually sweating. This is where we're at. My desk cleared the shelf, cleaned my bedside table. I've cleaned underneath my desk. Obviously still got so much crap. I've got a bin bag, that's like jumpers, I don't want to put them away yet because they take up so much room. Filled up this box, filled up that suitcase, filled up this bag, got my mirror there, filled up this bag. I got changed because I was so fucking hot. But Tom's probably on his way back so I need to get some more done. Um... Is it gonna fit? Hopefully. So it was a struggle to get my desk up here but they finally got it up. So that's why we wanted it and it fits really nicely. So I'm really happy with that because I need to put some like little um, folder things for like my notebook books. We've put this there for now. My little Ikea 9 Alex drawers. Excuse the orange, just my fake tan. I need to clean it. But I wanted some of like all our extra like shampoos and conditioners and stuff. So that's going to go in there. But I'm happy that that's fitted there. That's perfect. And this is the rest of the stuff from the move. We're now going to go to Ikea to go get the wardrobes and some other bits and bobs. How cute is this? So we got the little jar and we got these little biscuits from Ikea. That's so cute. And we got this washing up bowl. Um, right, so we're, we've been quite busy, well I haven't really, but <laughs> everyone's been building the wardrobes. Uh, you can put your map on. Just search B&M or Sainsbury's. Um, the boys have been building the wardrobes and Oh, I've been just getting stuff together. We are now, me and my mum are now going to B&M to get some cleaning stuff and because everyone's been working all day doing the house, we're going to get some, um, I think it's that one, um, we're going to get some pizzas and some little bits for everyone to have. So that is the plan. Yeah. Yay. Look at this. So it's been a little while, it's actually 10 past 12, um, everyone's gone now, we've literally got stuff all over the sides that I need to wash up. Um, me and my mum popped to B&M um, to do a little cleaning haul, so I got a scrub daddy, I got a grey one because I thought that will go nicely with the kitchen. Um, I got some tea and some sugar I thought it would be nice to have a nice cup of tea in the house, I want to test out the kettle. Um, and then we got some cleaning bits. So we got um, a bathroom spray, um, we got a lemon kitchen spray, a minky and some carpet spray. My mum's bought like more of my stuff over, like I've got some like boxes at home for like my food and stuff like pasta and stuff, so she's bought all that over. So we've just kind of got to decide where we're putting things. I've started washing things up and putting them away, so um, excuse the mess because we've all been having pizza. I've put now the cutlery and stuff in there, so that's looking a bit nicer. Um, yeah, we need to clean up all the stuff that we've just all been eating. I, we went to Sainsbury's to get the pizzas and we found some that nice squash. We got mango, passion fruit and peach and we got strawberry and rhubarb. So that's really nice. Um, but let me go and show you the wardrobes. So this is the new dressing room, so excited. I've got two wardrobes that are a metre long each. One's got two hanging, one's got hanging and drawers. The drawers are actually really big as well, which is really nice. Um, I've placed my mirror here, which I think is going to be really nice for like mirror pictures, outfit pictures. 
I'm thinking putting some shelves here because originally we were going to put them here but obviously that's not going to work now so thinking here for like bag shoes and I might put like my little book trolley down here or something when that comes but super happy with that and then because obviously Tom's didn't fit where we originally planned we've put Tom's here which we actually think looks really nice it fits really nicely in that gap so he's got again drawers hanging he's got little glass trays he wants to put like his aftershaves and stuff in here and then we've got a little bit of extra storage up there. I don't know why my camera just keeps going blurry. Um, yes, I think his looks really nice. Um, and then if we go to the bathroom, this was the mat we got from B&M. It's the Get Naked one. I've wanted this for ages, but we are going to put it in the shower room. We just put that in here. We will probably get another one. And then we got this bath tray from Danelle, which I think is really cute. Um... Yeah, I need to start putting some of these clothes into the wardrobes and we also need to start sorting out um, where everything's going in the kitchen. So that is the plan for now. Okay, please excuse Tom's videos in the background. I've basically been playing around with the cupboards and trying to get an idea of where we want things. I didn't realise the shelves moved in the cupboards, so that really helped things. Tom's currently testing out the camera chairs because that's what we've got to deal with at the moment. So thoughts at the moment, obviously this could change. I have like pantry stuff in here, obviously it looks very messy at the moment, but we want to get like pasta jars and things like that, which will obviously help things really well. I don't know what... So that's what's in there at the moment. I don't know why it's all blurry guys, I don't know what is going on with my camera. Um, so at the moment in here we've put like some Nutella and then like green tea and things like that. Some squash and breakfast stuff and then we're going to have vitamins and protein stuff in there. This is going to be the snack cupboard, so we've got sweet treats, crisps and crackers and then whatever else up there. In here is basically all my lovely cups that are really nice but Tom doesn't like. So they're hiding in there with like uh, Tupperware and my Starbucks cups. This huge cupboard has nothing in it yet so I need to think of a source for that. This one is going to have mugs there, drinking glasses, wine glasses and Prosecco glasses. Again, what is going on with the fucking camera? I don't know what's going on, everything's going crazy. Um, down here, obviously, we've got the cleaning cupboard. Um, down here, we're gonna have plates and cups, serving stuff, and then some of like pots and pans and things at the bottom. In here, we've got obviously at the top, we have cutlery and utensils. In here at the moment, we've got like chopping boards and like some other little gadgets. <laughs> and then we've got the baking trays at the bottom at the moment and then again that cupboard has nothing in it either um so we're still playing around but i'm really excited because when we were looking through the fridge they actually gave us some ice cube trays and my ice cubes still aren't here and they were like these big spheres and then some like long ones so test those out in the morning let's head upstairs <laughs> saw a few clips just trying to decide where i want everything i've literally put all my tops in i've got so much more space than i had in my old drawer because that one was always overflowing so i'm really happy with that um but yeah i basically haven't even touched my wardrobe at home and obviously all that needs to do the hanging so i need to like get that first before putting anything else in the hanging because i can't decide because obviously i've got some trousers and that they get creased in my drawers so obviously i want to hang those but i want to put like the jumpers in that up first um be yeah, our second day in our house done tom's asleep and i'm gonna go to bed now too because i'm gonna be absolutely shattered and um, tomorrow's plans are we need to pop back to my house again get the last bits out of my room or at least as much as we can um we need to go to costco because they're doing like this big pack of black velvet hangers which is what i want so we need to get those um maybe we need to get some food shop bits 
and I want to wash my hair tomorrow in the shower. So that's kind of the plan for tomorrow. Because I'll bring you with us um, from the morning to the evening. I'll film a little TikTok vlogs too because I know sometimes I'm not filming because obviously when we got people helping, I don't want to whip the camera out all the time, but obviously I'm doing as much as I can. So I did the first TikTok to get that up today, tomorrow I mean. Um, I was meant to edit the house vlog, but I just haven't had a chance to do that. So yeah, I'm gonna go to bed and I'll speak to you in the morning. Please excuse the noise in the background. I don't know if you can like turn it off. It's like an air purification thing. I'm not quite sure. Um, but the sun is shining. Um, so far we need to watch today how the sun moves in the garden to depict where we want to put things. So at the moment it's in this corner. So we'll see how it moves. Um, I've woken up. I actually slept quite well last night on the airbed. Didn't wasn't as bad as the night before. Um, so today's plans, so today's plans are, we're going to go back to my house this morning, well, in a little bit, go and get the rest of the stuff, basically, I've got, it's pretty much just clothes now, my books, um, the other TV, um, and we want to take one of the chest drawers, so there's a few bit, bits to get, and we're going to pop to Costco, because they do like this pack of, because I want my hangers obviously to match up, at the moment at home they don't, so I want to get packs of black velvet hangers and I think Tom's going to do the same just so it all looks nice and all matches. So we're going to get them from Costco and we need to measure some of the windows and we need to see if we can just for now just get some cheap poles and curtains from like B&M just so like we've got some privacy because at the moment I feel like I'm creeping about and everyone can see me. Sorry. So yeah, we um, need to definitely do that today because yeah, I just want a bit of privacy. Um, I'm going to wash my hair tonight so we'll test out the water with my hair. Um, but yeah, I like, wait, I keep like changing, um, I feel like my camera, like, I feel like I've pressed something or Tom's pressed something and it's gone really weird, so I think I need to play the settings at some point, but at the moment it's fine. Um, I've got some stuff that I left to try on the air, um, dry on that yesterday, so I'm going to put those away this morning, um, and then I'm going to make myself an iced coffee because I found those ice cubes yesterday. I am so excited, so I'm gonna make, I've only got like sachets at the moment because obviously I'm waiting for my espresso to come, should come next week at some point. Um, but yeah, so let's make a little iced coffee. I'm so excited to have a coffee in this cup because I think they always look so aesthetic. And it's so good. I love to have a glass straw now. I'm really bougie, so I'm going to go upstairs and drink this. So we just had a shower. Um, we need to get more towels because at the moment we only have this one. And we need to get another one. But this one's from Primark. And it really annoys me because it's really like bubbly. When you dry yourself, it just kind of like sticks to you. I'm literally kind of fluff. It's so annoying. Um, but I'm just going to brush my teeth and do my skincare. I'm going to use like all the usuals. And then I think we're going to drive what well, I found my Costco card. Hopefully, we can go to Costco because we really need to get those hangers so we can start hanging things up. Um, I, got, I do have hangers at home, obviously, to like them all to match. So, hopefully. I wake up, I don't want to make my bed I save up all my energy Instead you take up all the energy I have inside And I can't find a way to just ignore it And I can't really take it anymore Cause I can't stop you from running around through my mind 
stop running, never will I'll take some melatonin pills this time Cause I just wanna sleep tonight Yeah, I just wanna sleep But lately I've been sleeping way too much Cause baby, I've been dreaming So we've just arrived at Costco Cause we're gonna go get our hangers for our wardrobes Which is super exciting And um, we're trying to look for Wi-Fi deals at the moment Cause we need Wi-Fi Like we found one for Sky which isn't too bad It doesn't come until Friday But if worse comes to worse That's just what we're gonna do But I just, I'm excited to go get my hangers and start hanging things in the wardrobe. Okay, so I'm currently sat in the van. Tom's gone to the shop. We've just gone back. Feels like we're getting somewhere with my room. Basically, Tom took all the, you know, basically my drawers are always overflowing in my videos. He took the drawers out of them because we thought they were really broken, but they're not. Um, so we've taken all the drawers out and we're going to refix them. I don't know if we're going to keep both. We might only keep one set of drawers, like I said, for pajamas, underwear. I want to put it in the spare bedroom. Tom wants to put it in my dressing room, but I just don't think that's going to work. So I think we're going to put it in the spare bedroom behind the door. Um, just so that underwear, work clothes, pyjamas can go in there. Got some more hangers. We had some black hangers at home, which was good. So I collected those. Um, I'll give you our little Costco haul when we get back. We didn't get too much, just a few little bits and bobs. Um, I started sorting out the things in my wardrobe at home. So filled up loads of bin bags full. But there's still stuff in there, not going to lie. But um, we're getting there with that. At least I can start hanging things and have an idea of how much room I've got left. Um, got some dressing gowns, which I'm really happy about. Got my other towel. Tom got some shirts. Um, so, yeah, we got some more stuff, which is good. We got our HelloFresh recipes. So, feeling good. We're going to head back to the house now. One of our family friends is actually having a barbecue today. So, it's her 50th. Um, so, we're hoping we can go to that because quite a lot of my family are going. Um, it kind of just depends what's going on because we've still got to get back, unload the lorry. Um, and then we've got the lorry, the van. And then we've got to obviously put some things away. We've got to go to B&M. We've got to do a food shop. We've got to drop the van back. So, and it's meant to be starting in about 20 minutes. So we're going to have to wait and see, I think. But hopefully we can pop in or something because that would be nice. But I'm so hungry. But my mum bought us some pasta yesterday. So I'm going to eat some of that when I get home. Yeah. So my mum went to Morrison's yesterday. And they had like loads of yellow, what's it called? Like discounted things. And they had like two massive tubs of pasta. So me and Tom are eating that currently right now and we've also got the rest of the pizza from yesterday and I think we're probably just going to have um, a ca- why is there literally no cans left? I go to the other one for yesterday. I think there's only two left. <laughs> okay so we're back from Lidl and B&M so I'll give you a little haul. So from Lidl got some bananas you know I love my bananas. So like right sorry if I'm a bit wonky we'll hopefully it'll be alright so we've got some bananas we got some tomato and herb pasta base to make some pasta. Got some blueberries, they were on like the buys of the week, they were only like a pound. Easy peanuts, I'm so excited to fill up my little fruit bowl. Um, we got some tikka masala, I thought we have some like kind of curry situations. We had some things here so we thought we might as well just use those. Plasters, paracetamol, just the essentials, leave them in the house. We're gonna have sausage and mash tonight, so I picked up some mashed potato. We got some, what's the other one? Salt and pepper, obviously you need those in the house. We got some grapes. I got some yogurt for my granola. I got some coffee to fill up my little coffee pot. So we've got coffee in the house. Gravy, just so we've got it and for dinner tonight. And some beef for the curry. Um, we also found these tropical crushers, so we got those, and um, we got, well Tom got a big outfit for lunch, and then at B&M we basically just got the rest of the clothing and stuff we need, and then we also wanted to look at curtains, we forgot to measure, so we just bought them and we can return them if they don't fit, so at the moment our main priority is the living room and the bedrooms, that's where we want privacy at the moment, so we've got two of these black poles, and then we got two of these like kind of neutral grey curtains and then again these are a bit more grey got one of these so hopefully they're going to fit where we want them cleaning wise we got a duster obviously essential got some fabulosa wipes these are in a blush bay they smell really nice i got some sif lemon cream cleaner i've seen a lot of people use this in like kitchens on like their stoves and stuff so gonna try that out um got 
some pink stuff toilet cleaner um, some windoline I'm going to use this on my mirrors and obviously the windows so hopefully that will work all right got some mold and maju blaster the apple one i see a lot of people use this in the bathrooms to get rid of the mold like clean the tiles and stuff got the toilet fizz and freshers these are the pink penny fresh they look so cute for the toilets um got some microfibers these ones have cute little dogs on and the rest are like just gray um and i've seen amber knight use these they're the glow white you put them in your washing with the white and apparently it makes everything go white because my biggest and like, the thing that's annoys me the most is i'll wash our socks and they just never look clean so when our, our washing machine is coming on saturday i don't know if i said that or not um so i'll test it out then and see if it works so that's our like little haul so i'm going to put everything away and then yeah i think tom's just watching the rest of the f1 so i'm just going to tidy this all away and then we can uh see if the curtains will fit and obviously we've got to bring everything in from the van <sighs> so yeah okay so we've cleared the floor in here tom's currently cleaning this big ass tv um literally got rid of pretty much everything it's all in the um second bedroom just my brother and sister, my brother and sister, <laughs> my brother and his girlfriend are coming over, so he wanted to clear some space. So we've just put a few things over here, and everything else is in the bedroom upstairs. So we can sort that out later. But yeah, Tom's just giving this screen a clean, um, and hopefully it'll be okay. And then I'm going to go around with our new little Hoover and just Hoover up all the little crumbs and things. And um, we've put all the cardboard and stuff outside, and some of the rubbish in the bins, just so it's out the way. But it's looking fresh. I'm going to put my white company diffuser on uh, that we got as a gift from the developers give it a little fragrance so my brother and his girlfriend have just been around for a little bit we've been trying to set up the tv so i'll show you in a minute we're, we're setting up the tv and trying to set up this like tv program thing so hopefully that'll work we're gonna have sausage and mash for dinner so got these sausages and then just got a microwave mash because obviously pots and pans are coming tomorrow so we're gonna test out the grill i'm just gonna cook all of them because they got a date today um so yeah let's cook dinner so here's our first meal we had to play around with everything because the microwave i think we figured we have to put on high for it to be like our microwave at home so did that sausages were just being so annoying they just wouldn't turn over when i wanted them to so hopefully they are actually cooked um it looks really shit but you know it's just our first little meal in the house so i've come up to the dressing room i cooked dinner it was really nice just really hoping those sausages cooked like i just don't know because i haven't used the oven before it stressed me out they felt really nice to like cook dinner in our own house. Obviously in my dressing room and I really want to start sort this out today. I have, I'll show you. This is my tops. I don't know where's that come from. Um, these are my tops. This is sorted and I've got so much. I need to move that in there as well, I do. <laughs> um, I've got so much more room than I did before, which is really nice. Um, I started doing this one, which is going to be my gym drawer. Draw. This is like trousers that aren't going to be hung up. And then this one, I'm not quite sure yet. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna play around with it. I'm thinking any trousers that need to be hung up here, and then maybe dresses there or there. I don't know, I'm gonna play around with it, and I'm also gonna do a bit of Tom's too. So I'll show you as much as I can. So we're going to attempt to put the curtains up. We've got like these neutrally ones, whoa, 
for the living room. They're really thick. And they're like a really nice gradey colour, kind of the theme we're going for. And then we've got these black poles. So I'll, we'll try and put them up. And if we do, I'll show you the finished result. Okay, so I'm going to wash my hair because it's literally half ten. I'm going to try and put up the curtains right now because he completely forgot. I asked him to put the curtains up and do the wash, uh, the hand, what am I talking about? Wash the dishes while I was doing the wardrobe. Did he? No, he forgot. So too busy for watching the football. I've just found whatever shampoo conditioner I could find in my bag. So I've got the Colorwell Color Security Shampoo and the John Frieda Vibrant Shine Conditioner. I'm gonna wash my hair with those and I'm also gonna use the Bayless and Hardin Plant Collagen Body Wash. Um because yeah, I need to wash my hair because I've got work tomorrow. So let's go and see you when my hair is wet um so it's now half 11 i'm actually heading to bed i washed my hair in the shower and it was so nice um feel really fresh now ready for a new day um tom managed to put the curtains up we put them a bit too high they do look quite nice though for like a b&m cheap curtain so i'm happy with those and we just need to sort them out tomorrow right? so i told him we're not gonna do that now because obviously neighbors need to go to sleep um i can't bother to walk back downstairs so i'll insert a clip when i wake up in the morning of the curtains um but yeah, we're going to head to sleep on our little air bed, ready for work tomorrow, which I'm dreading. I just wish we had more time to get things done, but it's fine. It just is what it is. So, good night. So, our new pots and pans have arrived that my brother and his girlfriend got. They're so nice. They're from a brand called Casanova. And they've got this really nice, like, speckly design and these wood handles. So, really excited about these. So, I'm going to put these away. Tom also got us some pasta bowls today from... B&M and some chocolate stock up so that's really really exciting so I'm happy with that we've just emptied all our stuff into the skip so I forgot to show you last night Tom oh, um, but as I said he just put them a bit too high so we're going to redo them tonight but they're a really nice colour so I'm happy with them so I'm just inserting this little clip into the end of this vlog because I definitely did not end it um, but yeah, it was really fun to like film the little movie vlogs. I feel like I didn't film like too much, but it was like just enough. I did some stuff on TikTok as well if you want to see stuff on there. Um, but I hope you're excited for the house content because I'm really enjoying it so far. And we've got more to come. Um, so I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, then please subscribe and I'll see you next time.